Hey guys, today is Thursday and it's not the first time I ran this week. I ran yesterday, Wednesday. I did the Kipchoge challenge. I will link that here so you guys can check it out. If you want to, I explain what it is in the video. And now I am wrapping up my four miler. I just finished. And I am listening to Michael Jackson's Studio, which is very fitting because Halloween is around the corner and all the houses have decorations. Most of them, not all of them, but most of them. So, yeah, it was just a relaxing run because yesterday I had to do the Kinchogi Challenge. I ran super fast and I still have like cramps in my legs, which proves that sometimes you're used to doing these long runs and they're not really working your fast twitch muscles, which I think I worked yesterday, given I have cramps. So, but yeah, I'm gonna let you go, guys. See you tomorrow. Look at the sky, you guys. So blue, unbelievable. It was raining yesterday, the whole day. And I thought I wasn't gonna be able to run this morning, but it was. Today is Friday. Um, I am putting five miles. And then tomorrow I have to do my long run because I can't do it Sunday. So, because of scheduling conflicts with my son's marching band. So, and we, still, we still have four more weekends like that in which I'm gonna have a scheduling conflict. So, yeah, so tomorrow I'm gonna do my long run. Today I have five miles. I've been running two and a half, so I'm gonna turn around. But yeah, it's a beautiful day. With how much it was raining yesterday, it's just unbelievably beautiful. I love days like this. Okay, I finished my five miles. I did them at a leisurely pace. It actually took me like an hour. So, but um, my legs are tired. So I didn't want to overstress them too much. Just again, tomorrow I have my long run and tonight I'm gonna be standing for a while too. So with Again, my son's marking there. So, so yeah, um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully it's as nice as today. Okay, good morning you guys. Today is Saturday and it's super late. It's 10.30. I slept in because we got home yesterday at 11.30. It was a very, very long day. Lots of walking. Um, yeah, and I was just so exhausted. It, I've, I don't know how I'm gonna survive marching band. Um, we have four more weeks of this. So right almost till the marathon. And that was my husband, he just called me because yesterday during the performance at one of the local high schools uh, during the football game, they, um, my son lost his uh, pearl, the thing that pushes the trumpet. So one of them, and it's really uncomfortable to play with it. So because this happened at night, you can't just go to the store and buy one and um, they are performing today again. He's already practicing. So my husband went back to the high school. He drove like 20 minutes <laughs> to get there to see if he could find it on the grass and it's a huge football field obviously. So hopefully he finds it. He just called me. Um, just requesting some more specific directions, but who knows? I don't think he's gonna find it. We're gonna have to order it and it takes like two weeks so, because it's a very specific piece that needs to be specifically for his trumpet. So, who would have known? Anyway, I'm gonna see if I can run. If I run six miles, I'm happy. I have to be back at 11.30 because I need to be at the high school at 12.40, so yeah. So, as I was finishing my run, I was turning around the corner. 
my husband called me and said that he found the pearl for the for my son's trumpet so and then my phone died <laughs> how about that so yeah I don't even know how many kilometers I did because my phone died so I can't get the information from the Fitbit to the phone I'm gonna have to check later I don't think I did more than five kilometers like three miles three point something maybe four so but yeah now I have to take a shower quickly grab something to eat and head over to my son's high school we have a performance at 6 45 but it's a long drive on the buses so and of course the kids have to get dressed and all that so yeah I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow <laughs>